And um, I'm just going to end by saying really two or three very brief things about what I've heard today and really to say what a great lineup of speakers we've had. Uh, and I think what we've heard quite a lot this afternoon is realism tempered by hope. And all three of our speakers have given quite a bit of a challenge in terms of just what uh, the challenges are in our sector, in social care, in healthcare, and the pressures that exist. But also some of the optimism that they see in the organisations they work in and they lead, uh, and some of the opportunities. And I think the reason they've said that is because fundamentally this is a people business that we're in, and that if we view it as a people business and we take the power of stories like the one we heard from Mike this morning, and indeed the inspiration we've just had from Martin and his own reason for becoming involved in this sector, we begin to perhaps have an opportunity to think about how, as Martin uh, Green said earlier on, we're not offering a service here, we're offering ways in which people can actually realise their potential and have the lives they lead. Just two final things I would say. One is I love the image of Kaplunk, and I'm going to get an image overnight because I think that's fantastic. And I also love the image of being pirates. Don't wait for permission, don't look up to be told what to do, actually be an activist keen to make change happen where you can, because even those small changes that Martin was talking about in his presentation can make big, big differences in the lives of people. Just the fact that Mike said this morning, uh, he'd never read a poem in his life until he was asked by someone he was caring for to share in reading poems. Just that human contact, not high tech, but by golly, high impact, making a huge difference in that person's life but actually just having that ability to look below the surface and understand the real problems that are driving what people really want. And again, I think uh, Helen's point there about that troubled family that could have been evicted because no one had looked beneath the surface and understood why they were behaving in the way they were. These things add up to the approach that we need to be taking as a sector, looking to be there, getting beneath the surface, understanding the ways in which technology can play its part. Enjoy this evening. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow morning, bright, bushy-tailed and eager to hear more from this plenary stage. Thank you very much for your attention.